this is Mary from Reviewer's Diary. I'm here with my Ipsy Glam Bag Plus. I think it's a fantastic value and honestly I have subscribed to both BoxyCharm and Ipsy Glam Bag Plus and I do have to say that um, I, I think that Ipsy listens to what my preferences are for the most part. So anyway this is a really cool bag and I'm going to go ahead and it's like the stuff was so much that it almost didn't fit in there even though I tried to jam it in. First we'll do these um, brushes. They There were not a lot of items when I came to the choice area where these brushes were. These ended up being the smartest choice I think. Um, the brushes are really really pretty brushes. It is a good brand. It's That's Cruelty 3. It's M-O-T-O MOTD um, and I'm tempted to keep these so I'm going to leave them in the package until I make a decision because they might actually end up in a giveaway otherwise um, but I, I really like these so we'll have to wait and see okay so the next item I'm just going to grab in an order of what I feel and this was one of my choice items. Um, there were quite a few good choices in the line that this, um, in the choice area that this was in. Um, I'll always pick a Cora's product since I know they're cruelty free. And this has pre and probiotics and it's foaming cream cleanser. So it's not supposed to dry you out. It's supposed to be like somewhat moisturizing. And um, so I'll let you guys know. This is my second one. I did manage to get a foaming uh, Cora's cleanser in Fat Fit Fun a while ago, um, which I think I was going to have to, well, I'm going to be testing this out for you guys. Um, there's another video for that. Um, so I won't be putting this into my routine until after I test the new product that I bought so that I could review it for you guys. So you don't have to. Anyway, this is Prime Set and Refresh Dewy Finish Face Mist. Now this is 2.7 ounces. So anyway, this is one hit. Um, I believe it's cruelty free. Uh, let's see, vegan and cruelty free it says. This is a spray that you can put on before you put your makeup on, after you put your makeup on, and in between, anytime. So I'm really intrigued by this and this was one of the items that I um, was able to choose and so I did choose this. Actually all three of these items were choice items. Um, so now on to the items that were chosen for me. Okay and there were two items chosen for me. Uh, fortunately now Ipsy shows you what the items are so that you don't duplicate things that you don't need. So this is Advanced Antioxidant Serum. It works to fix your imperfections and illuminate your dull skin. So yeah, that's pretty cool. It's a one fluid ounce container. This stuff is enormously expensive. Um, the entire line actually is expensive. So anyway, that is something that I will look forward to using. Now this is Phenomenal Gel and it's a neutralizing moisturizer by Pixie. Now, Pixie's not one of my choice skincare brands, uh, not something I would normally pick up. I do like some Pixie items, but this phenomenal gel aloe vera and chestnut um, moisturizer is supposed to, and it's 1.7 ounces, it's supposed to neutralize the acid so that it's a naturally pH balanced moisturizer. So I don't know. It's a gel moisturizer, which might be perfect for me for the summer. I have normal skin, not oily, not dry, but some things can be drying for me. And I am dependent on moisturizer now. So I'm not sure how I feel about this, but I will, I will give it a try. So I feel like I got some really good items. One of the things that I like about um, Ipsy Glam Bag is that most of my products are skincare. Um, this time I occasionally will pick a palette, but 
This time I got these brushes, which is, you know, a makeup item, but everything else is, well, this is a makeup item technically, but everything else is skincare, and that I do like because I do like trying new skincare. I'm going to be reviewing more skincare for you guys um, as I start using things, um, and I am going to start off by reviewing this for you, um, and then I will probably move into this foaming cream cleanser because it really intrigues me so um yeah so anyway i really like all these items i like that i was able to pick three items the only thing is i would have hoped that there would have been less you know i mean there were like three things to pick out of this category and i remember looking at them and going well have that have that have that don't need that and ended up with the brushes um so which might end up in a giveaway so anyway i am happy with this stuff but you know um i'm happy with everything that i picked kind of with the exception of the brushes they're very really pretty um i am going to be doing a giveaway with you guys very soon so if you're not already subscribed to my channel you should go ahead and subscribe i will be um putting up a separate video entirely for our giveaway so that will be coming up shortly um i'm at 2.3 thousand subscribers so 2300 um and i would like to get up to 2500 but i'm not going to wait for that number to do a giveaway for you guys so anyway thank you very much for watching this has been mary um, by the way, the cards, since you pick your own stuff, most of the time they're not able to put together a card that's got everything that you picked on it. So um, you don't no longer get those cards. So anyway, this is uh, definitely a good bunch of stuff. And thank you very much for watching. This has been Mary with Three Viewers Diary with my Ipsy Glam Bag Plus. This is a box I highly recommend. Um, to anyone who loves, I don't know, pretty much anything. Cause some people get a lot of makeup. Uh, you put your preferences in, and I did put in eyeshadow. So every now and then I do get an eyeshadow palette offered to me. But um, most of the time I get skincare, which is what my preferences actually show. So anyway, thank you very much for watching. This has been Mary with Reviewer's Diary, and this has been a quick unboxing of my Ipsy Glam Bag Plus for March. Thank you very much, and have a beautiful evening. Good night.